Hello guys, this is Thursday, July 19th. Uh, the conditioning is called grind. Every minute on the minute, every minute on the minute times 20 minutes. Minute one is 20 second AMRAP dumbbell thrusters, 50, 35 per hand. Minute two is a 200 meter run. Minute three is a 20 second AMRAP of dumbbell burpees. Minute four is 18, 12 cals on the row. Okay, so 20 second AMRAP of dumbbell thrusters basically means you're gonna put these dumbbells on your shoulders and you're gonna be a piston for 20 seconds. Down and up, down and up, down and up, down and up, down and up. 50, 35 is definitely a weight that you could strap on and grind through. It's 20 seconds, guys. So make sure that you're just focused on your breathing, but close your eyes and go hard for 20 seconds. You'll have a full 40 second break. The 200 meter run and the cows on the road, this is 45 seconds or less of work here today. I want you guys to just focus on really effective breathing and, and making sure that you have really good posture in the run. Those of you that were here on 4th of July with me, we were talking about running and pulling and it's not pushing off the ground, you're pulling yourself off the ground. Really focus on that. Uh, the cows on the row, just think about a really good number of 45 seconds of steady good effort. And think about what you're doing on the row. Are your, your arms are your arms extending first before you go back into that catch? Are you bending your knees? Think about really good pulling principles and this is a good place to fix it. The dumbbell burpees, very similar to the thrusters. I think this is a way you could just get down there, down and up 20 seconds. But these workouts like the dumbbell thrusters and the dumbbell burpees for this, what I really like about here is how many times do you really know how many how many you could do in 20 seconds, right? But this is a good way to know, right? One, you could see if you're getting it consistent because you're gonna have five rounds uh, to be able to try to fight for it, right? And then also too, now if you're in a workout and you have 10 thrusters, you know that you could do 10 thrusters in 20 seconds if you had to, or eight thrusters, it really doesn't matter. The main thing that you're doing is you're getting information about you, how you move, how you train, how you breathe. And so really let this be a place of self-awareness where you're seeing where you could do it. Maybe you're finding out that the combination of rowing to thrusters is something that cripples you. Just learn about yourself during these EMOMs because what's great about them is they keep coming back around and they keep giving you a break. So during these breaks, you can really see how efficient you are with your time. Okay guys, enjoy grind.